Donald Trump may be on fire in the polls, but by angering Latino voters with white-hot immigration rhetoric, some Republicans fear he could torch the GOP's chances in 2016. Trump builds walls, I build walls. Consider Trump's latest proposal and birthright citizenship in the Constitution to crack down on the undocumented. I don't think they have American citizenship. We have to start a process where we take back our country. Our country is going to hell. Playing catch up on the issue, some Republicans are now following Trump's lead. Going forward, I believe we should change the rules, the law. It's a risky move for the GOP. Trump's heavy handed comments on Mexicans may excite parts of the conservative base. They're bringing drugs, they're bringing crime, they're rapists, and some. I assume are good people. Polls show it's a big turnoff for Hispanics. As far as a wall being built, I mean, this isn't China. Republicans have seen this movie before when Mitt Romney ran to the right on immigration in 2012, saying the undocumented should just deport themselves. They're going to self deport where they to a place where they can get work. Romney lost the Latino vote by a wide margin, continuing a downward trend for GOP nominees. We need to be in the inner cities. We need to be in the barrio. We need to be everywhere saying, hey, we want to renew this economy and grow it for youth. That's not the Trump message. Democrats have taken the opposite approach, courting Hispanics as their numbers are growing. America was built by people who said something different, who said, yes, we can, who said, si, sí, se puede. Hillary Clinton could go one step further pick a Latino running mate like HUD Secretary Julian Castro. She slammed Trump's citizenship ideas. And certainly from my perspective, uh, what is being said by those running on the Republican side is uh, incredibly offensive. And it is uh, unrealistic. It is mean-spirited. 